I've been watching this rabbit for a few minutes hoping that he would turn his head as I usually don't like taking shots between the eyes in a rabbit because I've seen the pellets ricochet off the sloped forehead but I'm using a fairly high powered air rifle and at 30 yards I take the shot on. These rabbits have been chewing the uh, farmer's flowers and a uh, small vegetable patch and I took the shot leaning over his garden wall. It's a heavy doe rabbit and you see the 30 foot pounds of the air rifle has pierced the uh, rabbit in the forehead and the pellets come out through the back of the head just below the ears giving a good uh, clean kill. I'll set it down here at the gateway and come back and pick it up later. Now further up the fields, I'm slowly approaching the uh, gateway here, hoping that there'll be a rabbit or two on the inside of the field as it's been freshly cut for silage. But when I spotted this rabbit, I dropped my shooting sticks at my feet which made a loud thud and spooked the rabbit before I got the shot off. Later on, further down the fields and make my way through this gateway, Again, a spire rabbit about 30 yards away, chewing a nice fresh grass coming up through the silage field. So uh, I duck down, take the game bag off, and try and get into a shootable position using the long weeds on the left hand of the screen there to try and cover my approach. You can see I'm breaking in a new suit of camouflage there. It's a Danish army. But I only get the camera onto the rabbit and in focus when he ducks out of the road. But about 30 yards up the field, I spot this rabbit. He's seen me, that's why he's standing up on his back legs. But I'll try and get uh, within reach of that gate and use it as a uh, rest to a steady shot. So I duck back in behind the weeds again and slowly approach the gate, shouldering the rifle as I come up to it. Again the camera is out of focus but I ain't waiting for it this time and take the shot at about 25 yards. It's only a young rabbit, but with the luck I've been having the night, it's very welcome. Further down the field I see this, it's uh, fresh fox dung. The farmer said uh, the night they were cutting the silage they seen at least four in the field. But on the way back I decide to check the garden out again. Coming up to the garden wall I peer over, sure enough there's a rabbit or two, but Again, they're just too quick for me. So feeling somewhat uh, defeated the night and outsmarted, I decide to call it an evening. <laughs>